Welcome to Math Stuff. Um, today we continue the tutorials on using LaTeX. And for those who are watching this for the first time, uh, LaTeX is a sort of code or a software that uh, lets you uh, write mathematical expressions on the web and in some documents. So in this tutorial, we're going to learn how to write um, LaTeX um, or how to write uh, radicals rather using LaTeX. So let's start. The first is square root of 5. How do we write a square root of 5? So again, uh, we're using GeoGebra here because uh, GeoGebra is easy to use and you can preview the the LaTeX output immediately. So let's start by square root of 5. So we use the text tool and then click click on the graphics view. So we type the code here. The code for square root is backslash and then SQRT and then open and close braces. So, or uh, open and close curly brackets. So the brackets here, whatever you put inside or between the pair of uh, brackets, that's what will be inside the or under the radical. So here we want to put five. So we just type five between the two brackets. And to see what will the code look like, we just check the LaTeX formula. So this is the output. Okay, maybe I'll make it a little larger so that you will be able to see to see them clearly. Okay, so these are the desired outputs. Second, um, yeah, okay, let's make this a little bit larger. The second is square root of x plus 2. Now, the square root of x here is separate from the from from uh, from 2 and as you can see the radical here uh, x is only under the radical and 2 is not under the radical. So how do we write this code? We have square root of x. So remember that what whatever is inside the brackets or between the brackets these are the things or these are the the letters or variables or numbers under the radical sign so we only need x here so we just put x between the brackets and then plus 2 okay okay so there we go next this time, both x and 2 are um, under the radical sign. So x plus 2 must be... Okay, let's type first. So x plus 2 must be inside or between the brackets. Okay. Okay, so square root, open bracket, and then x plus 2, and then close bracket. Next, this one is the two um, variables here are separate and we have two squared signs so we need to create two sqrt code. So we have slash sqrt, what is inside or what is under this radical sign here, we have a and then plus is outside, outside the radical sign. So plus, and then another squared, sorry. And then what's inside here is, B. okay. Next, what about this one? 
cube root of 5 plus square root of 2. And the square root of 2 is under the, the radical sign of cube root. So to create cube root, we have square root and then the index here. The index is 3 for cube root and of course uh, fourth for four for uh, fourth root, five for fifth root and so on. And then open and close bracket. What's inside is, what is under this is five plus square root of two. So five plus, so we have a square root sign here. So we must put the square root sign inside also the pair of brackets. So slash square root and then another pair and what's inside this pair is 2. Okay. And there we have it. Next, squared 3 over 2. So this is a combination of the previous tutorial, which is uh, fractions. We have a fraction here. And the numerator is, numerator is uh, squared 3 and the denominator is 2. So as we have learned before, to create a fraction, you must type slash and then a frac and then open close brackets. What's inside the first pair is the numerator of the fraction and the second pair is the denominator. So inside this pair is squared of 3, which is the numerator of the fraction. So squared of 3 and then Inside the second pair is the denominator, which is 2. Okay. Okay, so there we go. So that's it. I hope you have learned something. See you in the next tutorial.